going to be a long two and a half days. Morning everybody, welcome back to my channel. Today we're going to be working on a bunch of different things. Today is going to be, among other things, a production day. Today is Wednesday. It's about 10 o'clock at the moment. I've finished off my morning routine and chores for the day. I have about two and a half days left to my next market. My next market's coming up this Saturday and I've got a couple of other obligations over the next couple of days. So in all, instead of three, I'm going to say I've got about two to two and a half days to take care of everything. It's a really short window. I've got lots to restock, lots of new designs to whip up. So I'm not really sure how much I'm going to get done. Um, last weekend was a brilliant weekend of markets. I did film a few snapshots and snippets of the setup of the market. If you haven't seen that video here, I'll leave that linked. Go ahead and check that out after you finish watching this one. But enough said, I'm going to get back to working on uh, products. And first task of the day is to prep a few more wire headbands. I am running ridiculously low on the wire headbands, so I'm going to work on two sets of them so to say one's more a floral very spring sort of vibe uh, that i'm going for and those are fabrics i believe you've seen in the past but you'll see them again while i'm um, cutting them up and putting together the headbands the second lot that i'm hoping to get done um, in these next couple of days is that linen collection i'd recently showed you the fabrics that i picked up they're all plain, solid, beautiful fabrics, beautiful colors. Um, I think a couple of them are stripes and checks if I'm not mistaken. So I really, really want to get uh, those done. Uh, I know a lot of you who have come along to markets have been looking for solid colors and I've been, <laughs> and I, I told you that I'm gonna be working on those. So I'll hopefully get to putting all of those together today. Um, it's going to be a long two and a half days, but let's see how much we can get done. Enough talking, let's get cutting. I also have to share this little snippet with you. I went to Spotlight the other day to have a look for some Halloween fabric like I said I would in the previous video, and I could not find anything at a reasonable price fabrics gotten so ridiculously expensive it's not even funny and the options out there mm, not very impressive I think I'm gonna have to bite the bullet and go over to a spotlight um, a little further away from me because my local just doesn't seem to have it I literally found one fabric that I really really liked I haven't seen this one before I don't know whether that's because they they're moving fabrics around or I just didn't spot it up when it was out so I've grabbed a few of this it's a very quirky sort of fabric that's what it looks like I think it's going to look stunning as a wire headband so I'm going to whip that one up as well during this prep
So that's the stack that I've got going to begin with. It, it is 2.15 in the afternoon and uh, yeah, the cutting is done. Now all that's left to do is to fold these and get them ready to sew, trim the edges to give it that tapered look and uh, we'll move on to the sewing machine. This next stage does take a bit of time so I'll check in with you when that's done. It is four o'clock at this point and all my fabrics been prepped. Now we've got to go and stitch these up. Good morning everyone. Uh, today is Thursday. It's just about 9.50. So 10 minutes to 10 in the morning. And uh, I did manage to get a bit done after my last check-in yesterday. So it doesn't look like much, but I managed to sew up all of these headbands. So these are all of the pieces that needed the white thread to stitch up. So I've gone ahead and done all of that. And a few of the scrunchies in the same fabrics that have been done up. Today we're going to move on to the other colors that need a change of thread and such. So my next check-in will be once those are all sewn up. Just a quick catch up right now. It's about 5.15. I have finally finished sewing this great big pile of headbands. I counted there's 92 of them here and uh, we've got a few that were stitched up yesterday as well. So really happy with that. That's over a hundred headbands in so many different colors and prints. Uh, this launch is going to be a really interesting one. So anyway, next step is to flip these inside out and then to the ironing board. I'm not sure how much I'm going to get done today because I'm a bit tired from... Uh, I've been at the sewing machine non-stop, so we'll see how much more I can get, get done today. Today's going to be a bit of a struggle because yesterday was a full-on day of... Uh, production. Today is going to be the same. I've got over a hundred headbands to iron and then insert my wire, finish them off. I have to finish everything off by about 6.30 this evening because at 7 I have another I have another uh, personal commitment to attend, uh, to attend to. Now whether or not it's all going to get done by 6.30 is left to be seen. I'm really really hoping that I can get it all done though.
I just thought I'd stop for a minute and give you a glimpse of some of those gorgeous headbands that we're working on at the moment. These are all solid colors. You guys have been asking for a wider range of colors. So I'm really happy with how these have turned out. I mean, take your pick. I honestly cannot pick my favorite out of all these. Today is a ridiculously warm day, at least with all the ironing, it feels like that. But I'm super happy with how those uh, cotton linen headbands have turned out the solid colors. I'm just gonna get along and do the rest of them and I'll check back with you when they're all done. It is 6.45, it is the end of the day. I'm calling it the end of today. Uh, I think I was a little ambitious when I started off <laughs> and tried to figure out what I would get done today. I did not anticipate how long it would take me to iron those linen fabrics. They drove me insane. But I'm happy to report that all of those headbands have been ironed off. So 115, I think, or so. They're all ironed and... Uh, all that's left now is the wire and finishing it off. But I'm not going to be able to do that today. I am absolutely knackered. So this weekend's markets are going to... I, I will be able to manage this weekend's markets without the new stock. It would have been nice to release the new colors and prints um, this weekend. However, I've got more than enough stock to take me through to next weekend. And... Hopefully in the early half of next week, I should get around to finishing off these headbands. So what I will do is I will continue this vlog after the markets are done when I continue working on the headbands. Hi guys, quick catch up. Today is Tuesday. So over the weekend, um, I've been to a weekend market. So last week, you know, I had started out on some wire headbands as part of our spring collection. And as much as I wanted to, I couldn't get it done before the weekend markets. Monday after markets is usually a little bit of a reset day for myself. I take it a little easy as well as use that opportunity to get on top of uh, things like social media, um, a little work around the house, some chores, meal planning and such. So all of that's done. I also had a couple of completely random little errands around the house made myself some made myself a new curtain nothing fancy but something for the bedroom because it gets really bright now it gets bright much earlier now as we head into warmer days and um, my husband's a really light sleeper so we've got some we i managed to whip up a block out curtain and that it's really turned out nice it's basic it does the job so that took a bit of time yesterday this morning we had to, I had to package a few orders. I've done that. I've gone to the post office and it is about three o'clock now. So pretty much halfway, more than halfway through the day. But I'm finally going to have the time to sit down and continue work on the wire headbands. Once those are done, I'll come back, let you know and give you a sneak peek of what they look like. So my next checkpoint will be once those headbands are done.
So the wire headbands are finally, finally finished. Note to self, do not set out to do such a massive release all at once within a span of a week. Like you've seen, two and a half days was a very short period of time and I really could not finish everything in the original planned time frame. The linen fabric was so fussy. It took so much longer to press those out, to iron those out, to wire them and all of that. It is ridiculous. Once this is done, I'm not really sure if I'm going to bring, if I'm going to continue carrying the linen fabrics. If it turns out that you guys absolutely love it, I will continue doing it, but I will plan that out a little better. Anyway, uh, they're done. They look gorgeous, by the way. I can't wait to bring them to markets and see what they look like on display. But that's all done with now. I'm going to end today's video here. My next video is going to be another massive one. So stay tuned for that one as well. If you've made it this far, thank you so much for watching. Thank you for watching the entire video. It really does mean a lot to me. If you enjoyed the video, any part of it, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. It really helps uh, boosting this video and showing it to more like-minded people like you that may enjoy it too. Also, if you haven't done so already, please subscribe to my channel and uh, leave me a comment. I love hearing from you guys. Uh, most of all, thank you for being here. I'll see you really soon in the next video. Till then, take care. Bye-bye.